the Illinois Department of Natural Resources, along with the Iowa DNR and Fish and Wildlife Service, coordinated with the Department of Transportation for Illinois and Iowa on the reconstruction of the Interstate 74 bridge over the Mississippi River in the Quad Cities. The Illinois Department of Natural Resources reviews thousands of projects each year in Illinois for impacts to fish and wildlife. During this review and in coordination with the other agencies, it was determined that there was a important mussel bed, many species, including state and federally endangered mussels. Divers search the river bottom and place mussels in a bag to be sent to the surface. On the surface, the mussels are processed, identified by species, and marked at your time. Mussels have growth rings just like trees to where as they grow, they add another ring. So you can tell where the last mark was and then how much they've grown since that time. The mussels are sorted out to be sent to one of six different relocation sites already determined to have appropriate habitat for those species. The relocated individuals will be monitored for several years to determine success, including mortality and recolonization. Female mussels that are pregnant are also sent to another hatchery that specializes in freshwater mussel work where the young will be propagated and later brought back to the construction area after construction is finished to help ensure recolonization of the area. Freshwater mussels are the livers of the river. They're filter feeders that eat plankton in the water and help keep the water clean for fish, wildlife, and people. They're also in a way like canaries and mines. If there's something wrong in the water, they help indicate that, such as pollution or other sediment or other issues um, in which they don't tolerate those conditions very well. So a good muscle bed is a sign of a good and healthy system.